Welcome to my YouTube channel where I simplify the web. In this video, I'm going to show you how to generate random numbers within a specific range in JavaScript. In JavaScript, you have the random method of the math object, which generates a random floating number between 0 and 1. I can show you this real quick. Let's say I assign the return value of the method to random variable. Then I'm going to console log the random variable. If I come here and I run this file, you can see this is a random number between 0 and 1. This is another one. This is another one. This is another one. This is another one. You can see different random floating numbers where the minimum is zero and the maximum is one now what if i want to generate a random number which is between maybe five and ten how do i do that well i can take advantage of this method and add few extra code to get a number that is within this range and i'm going to show you how i'm going to clear all of this let's start with declaring a function called get random this function is going to accept the minimum range argument and the maximum range argument the first thing i'm going to do is i'm going to get the random number that comes from math.random after getting that random number the next thing i'm going to do is i'm going to get the difference between the range which is going to be max minus mean and the third thing i'm going to do is i'm going to get a random number between zero and the difference how do i do that i'm going to call this variable random difference and to get that random number between zero and the difference that's going to be float random times the difference and i can show you with few examples so let's say the difference is five i'm going to pick this first value here that we got from our random number if i multiply this by five you see we have a number between zero and five let me pick this second value here copy paste times five you can see we have 4.77 which is between zero and five let me pick this fourth value here and i come here and i multiply it by five you can see we have 2.86 which is between zero and five so to get the random number between zero and the difference you simply multiply the random number that we got between zero and one times the difference now that we have this how do we get the random number between the minimum and maximum range i'm going to call this variable random range and this is pretty much going to be random difference plus the minimum now we know that the random difference is going to be between 0 and 5 so by adding the minimum to read then we know that we're getting a random number that is going to be either the minimum value or more than the minimum value and since we used the difference here then we know that it's not going to exceed the maximum range going to return random range here and let's apply this and see if it actually works i'm going to say get random 5 as the minimum 10 as the maximum I'm going to assign the result of this to get random and then I can console.log random and let's see if this works I'm gonna clear the console if I run this you see we have 7.47 which is between 5 and 10 if I run this again you see we have 7.6 which is between 5 and 10 we have 5.46 which is between 5 and 10 we have 6.29 which is between 5 and 10 now what if we actually wanted this to be a whole number instead of floating number then we can come here and use math.round and with math.round this is going to round the result of float random times difference to the nearest integer if I come here now and I run this you see we have 7 which is between 5 and 10 we have 9 between 5 and 10 we have 8 9 7 6 we also have 10 we have 8 8, we have 8 we have 7 i'm trying to see if we're ever going to get 5 oh we finally got 5 we can also apply other numbers here let's so let's say i apply 100 and um 200 let's go again 138 194 180 131 153 and you can keep playing with this as much as you like if you enjoyed this video please give it a like subscribe and also turn on notifications for more concepts i'll be simplifying in javascript